Yo, what is going on guys? This is the Dog Quizzle and welcome back to another one of my videos and in today's video I'm showing you a quick and easy guide on how to max out the affinity for Codsworth. Alright, so the first step of this video is obviously you need to have Codsworth unlocked um, and he needs to be able to be your companion. That's the easiest thing you can do. All you have to do is the second you get out of vault, come home, do the little mission with Codsworth and there you go, he's able to be your companion. Um, and the next step is uh, getting the materials you need and getting the weapon that I'm doing this with. It might not even have to be this weapon, but this is the weapon that I chose to do it with. And uh, then you're going to need um, the skill to unlock the weapon station, or the weapons workbench. Um, okay, once you have that, you need to go on into the weapons workbench then you need to get the whatever you want to call this the flamer okay once you have the flamer you need to go down and go to the compression nozzle if you don't have all these unlocked just you know work on getting the skills upgraded or if you really want to get a mod okay next step is get this vaporization nozzle okay once you have that all you have to do is once you get the vaporization nozzle just go to compression nozzle standard compression vaporization Compression, standard, compression, vaporization. Look at this. Cosworth instantly idolizes me. And if you want to keep on maxing that out, all you have to do is do this over and over and over again. He'll eventually get to the point where you can't even max it out anymore, and then it'll just stop um, getting him to love this. This is probably the easiest mod that you can... Not mod. This is probably the easiest exploit ever because you don't have to keep on you know making these over and over again because you already have them and see yeah he's done he's done uh, he's done he's not gonna give me whatever affinity I can have left um, I'm pretty sure this works on any other gun um, you know you can do it on one of these um, you can really do on anything, any gun that you want to use it on. Uh, Alright, and then now, I'm going to show you Cosworth. Okay, if I'm right, he should be back here. Which I am wrong. Let's just quickly find Cosworth. If I can't find him, I'll just run a siren to get him here. Search through these houses a little bit. Uh, 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 uh. All right, so I can't seem to find Cosworth. So, you know, if you can't find Cosworth, all you have to do is build a siren or a bell. Siren, the the, the okay. So the bell, it, they uh, he it attracts all of the um, settlers in this settlement or in any settlement. It just takes longer because they all walk but if you have the siren all you have to do is turn on the siren and every companion in the area will run here with with their weapons armed now we just gotta wait for Godsworth oh yeah and by the way in case you guys didn't know you can actually kill Mercy Marcy Long and Jun June or whatever once you've completed the Minutemen quests uh, it's, it's probably the best thing, because I killed Marcy the second chance I had in a different save. The first chance I had. Okay. Here we go. Sure, Cotsworth. What's up? Oh, just a little something I'd like to get off the old proverbial chest. I, I just want to say what an honor it is for me to accompany you. You've no idea the horror of these past two centuries of war. The initial destruction. Not knowing if you and your family were all right. It's a relief just to find the entrance intact. I'm sorry, Codsworth. It was so sudden. I, not even time for goodbyes. Not a single worry, sir. And I shared your priorities completely. Family safety first, above all else. And yes, while it was hard at first, I was able to eventually move on. At first, it was with the work. Busying myself day and night, and believe me, there was plenty of it. But eventually, the work became light chores, 
What truly saved me was my memories, sir. Memories of you and the missus. Young Shaw. Of your love and kindness. I soldiered on, fueled by hope that one day, if not you and the wife, that Sean, or perhaps Sean's children, would one day emerge. I'm glad you stuck around. Oh, sir, you don't know how good it is to hear you say that. I just wanted you to know how much I consider you family. I may be a mere robot to some, but I, I do hope you come to see me as more. I consider you to be family too, Codsworth. We're in this world for the long haul. Together. Mr. Dustin, <laughs> you don't know how wonderful it is for me to hear that. I feel completely recharged. Well, enough blither blather for me. Let's get back to it, shall we? See, that was the first one where he where he admires you. See, he idolizes me now. And I'm pretty sure once I come to talk to him again, Codsworth. It'll turn into another. Oh wait. Would you like to? Why yes, of course. Hmm. Well, come, oh, you can come with me first. Okay, send her to same place. Um. Okay, now. And here it is. Of course. Go right ahead. So gracious, sir. I do appreciate it. I've always had such admiration. Ever since the day my visual senses were first switched off, you and the missus, so good with young Sean and so trusting of me to look after such a newborn bundle of joy, it just warms my nuclear core. So you can imagine the distress I felt when the bombs fell. Are you closer to Vault? I searched but found no evidence of your death. I can only hope you all made it in time. And when you returned, I was overjoyed. I admit I ran a full diagnostic scan just to make sure I wasn't malfunctioning. <laughs> but the news, the news of the misses and Sean, believe me when I say it takes a true hero to live through that. I'm no hero, Godsworth. Believe me. Don't sell yourself short, sir. In such a bleak world as this, think of all you've witnessed and all you've done. In my 200 years, I've seen it tear good men and women apart. But you, sir, you have remained the very model of what humanity should aspire to be. Thank you, Codsworth. That means a lot. No thanks necessary, sir. I wouldn't hear of it. I truly believe if the Commonwealth is to turn itself around, you're the one to do it. Now, not another word. I stand firm in my belief. Let's get back to it. Having reached the highest level of affinity with Cosworth, you have gained the robot sympathy perk. Uh, you cannot actually romance with Cosworth at all because he's a robot and that would be weird. Hey, hey, um, Here you go. Yeah. Uh, relationship. How do you feel about us? Sir, why it couldn't be better? It only worries me that you feel the need to ask. Alright. And that is how you get the highest level of affinity for Cosworth. If you guys enjoy this video, like and subscribe for more. And uh, yeah, if you're new, sub, subscribe. <laughs> and uh, yeah, peace out, guys.